Hello everyone, welcome back. In this video, I'm going to show you the full ending of Vihermina's quest where she reveals her secret at the very end. So, spoilers. It is one of my favorite quests from this game. I was surprisingly shocked at the end. So I wanted to share with you in case you made different choices I ended up with a different ending. This is not going to be a quest guide. If you want a quest guide without the spoilers, I'll put the link to that video in the description. For everyone else, enjoy the story and I'm gonna shut up now. You have my thanks. Had I not noticed your presence, I might have slain him there and then. Tis no jest. You see, everything I've done these past few years has been leading up to this. I am here to kill him. But I cannot simply end his life, oh no. I must first expose his misdeeds. Only then will I allow myself to grant him the miserable end he deserves. Or oh, so I'd sworn, but I've yet to find a single shred of evidence. Perhaps the time has come to surrender this crusade. You would lend me your aid, but I've done nary a thing to earn it. And recall that I've devoted years of my life to his pursuit, with naught to show for my troubles. If the proof I seek yet exists, it will not be so easily uncovered. I suppose there is truly naught I can do, save deliver him a gruesome demise for all to behold, that is. Still, if you insist upon searching for evidence of his crimes, three days. I will give you three days to find what you seek. I shall wait patiently, though not with bated breath. So, you've returned. I confess, I thought you might not. I was ready to settle things myself. Well, did you find what you were looking for? Thank you. I can't believe you found this. All that remains is to end that man's life with my own hands. I've no other tasks for you. This partnership of ours has come to a close. Unless you intend to see this through till the end. You're a curious one, aren't you? But what's just as curious is that I can't bring myself to refuse you. All right, if you're offering your aid, then I'll gladly accept it. Come with me. Allard is in the room to the left. Go in and restrain him for me, would you? Never mind the mask. Consider it a charm of sorts. At last. It feels like an age has passed since... What is this? Who are you? Don't let him escape. I do not waste my time on the left. Get your hands off me, you fiend! Don't you know who I am? Oh, you hang for this impudence! Oh, Allard. I've always wanted to see you like this. Voice, Wilhelmina. But why? Why would you? Do you still fail to recall, even with this mask staring you in the face? But I suppose for a man such as you, 
a little murder here or there is hardly worth remembering. What mockery is this? In your youth, you slew two individuals. The merchant whom you served and his wife. They had a child, as I am sure you are aware. A newborn babe who was spirited away by her loyal wet nurse. You mean to tell me you were their child? But how can this be? Your mother, she was a beastron. Surely her child would be one as well. A fair assumption. But for better or worse, I didn't take after my mother. Save for in one respect. This is for my mother. And this is for my father. sins to come to light, Allard. Mr. Allard, has something happened? We've been noticed. I suppose a scream that hideous was bound to attract some attention. We can't leave the way we came in. Fortunately, there's a window here. I think it would be best for us to make our escape separately. Should we both make it out of this unfettered, let us meet at the Myrmacolian on the morrow. Till then, be well. Thank you. I finally achieved my purpose here and I owe it all to you. It would seem the residents of the palace have chosen to treat Allard's untimely passing as an accident. I imagine they deemed it safer not to make a fuss of the incident after perusing the evidence you uncovered for me. Shrewd as a den of foxes. <laughs> I'll give them that. I truly cannot thank you enough. But, I want to try. Just this once, I'll give you something special. I'll grant unto you the sweetest of dreams. I know not what I would do without you. You have my thanks, but it's time to say farewell for now. Just know that my bordelry will e'er be your haven, should you have need of it. Don't show why I... 